What's up, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. So, I was editing videos today and also going to class because, you know, school is important. And I got some bad news from this morning that a little bit of my childhood had just passed away. And that is Kirby Morrow. Kirby Morrow has been a voice actor and an actor for a very long time. And you might not recognize who this person is because, you know, sometimes we don't pay attention to the credits when, you know, shit, when TV shows or movies go off. But if you don't know about this dude, this dude, he is a real one. He played a major part in a lot of our childhoods. And I'm going to run down some animes for you guys that he played in and, you know, show some of the characters that he played over the years. But the main character that he played that a lot of us can say we know is Goku from Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball and Dragon Ball Super. Well, I don't think he played Goku in Dragon Ball, but I know Dragon Ball Z and Dragon Ball Super. He played Goku. And also, if you watch Stargate Atlanta, or I think it's just called Stargate, he was also in there as well. I didn't watch Stargate, but my stepdad did, so I know what Stargate is. And when I went back and looked at the episodes that he was in, or where he does pop up, he was on there. There's a lot of anime characters he played. Hell, he even played Cyclops from X-Men Evolution, and I loved X-Men Evolution. Now, Ninjago, I wasn't a big fan of Ninjago. Matter of fact, I'm not really a big fan of all the Lego animated series and or movies, but I can't add, it, it's mind blowing, man. 2020 has been the worst year for everything. For everybody, from anime to gaming to wrestling to comics to you name it, somebody's been affected by 2020. And 2020 is not going out going out without a fight because it took Chad with Bozeman. Now we're taking somebody that's been part of my childhood. Like all the animes he was part of that I can remember is of course Dragon Ball Z. Imuyasha, he played he played Miracle, you know, the dude, the perv, you know, always grabbing on booty, trying to get the ass. Um he played Gundam Wing. That was the one that kind of tripped me out. I was like, dang, he was in Gundam Wing? Then I went back and watched it, and he I could hear his voice. And Gundam Wing, I suggest people should go watch. Because even though, yes, a lot of people say they don't like, yo, you know, politics in their anime and stuff. If you can look past the, all of the politics in this anime, you'll, you'll like it. I just like Gundams because, you know, I like the giant Megazords and mechs and all that stuff. So I, th I think that's pretty dope. He played a lot of other characters, too. And it's just just sad to see that, you know, that he's not going to be around. That if Dragon Ball does keep going on, they might have to find they will have to find another voice actor. But I hope that day doesn't come now because I'm like, hey, look, he passed on so i think that we need to leave dragon ball alone but then again you know some people want to see dragon ball come back but just like i did for chavo bozeman i'm doing a video for you know kirby as well mr moro as well because of the fact that he played he played a huge part of my childhood so of course i'm gonna pay my respects to the real ones he's a real one for real no matter what people think about the animes he voiced on he still is a real one and you know god rest his soul thoughts and prayers go out to his friend, friends and family that loved him dearly um it's just he's in a better place now that's all i can say and i i leave the video off with this tomorrow's not promised to anyone so at least try to make the day worth the wild do something positive spread some knowledge you know show love you know tomorrow's not promised to anybody i can go to bed tonight and not wake up tomorrow morning but at least i know that the day before I passed away, I at least did something great and dropped some knowledge on somebody or showed some love or spread some positivity. Because, like I said, tomorrow's not promised to anyone. Tell your loved ones you love them. Tell, you know, just just go out. If, if tomorrow's going to be your last day, just go out with a bang. Live life to the fullest. But, guys, that's all I got for you. I pray for everybody's health and well-being. 2020 has been a long year. And we're almost through it, but hopefully that 2021 is better. But other than that, guys, I love y'all. Take care of yourselves. Peace.